Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to be giving this wonderful girl some bright red highlights with a nice dark red brown base. Kind of refresher from her old red that she had. So I'm actually first starting by parting her hair into six sections, giving her six triangles all the way to the apex of the head. I'm going to be using Pure Light Power Lightener by Pravana. I'm going to be mixing that with a 20 volume developer. Now that I have put her hair into six sections, I'm going to start with the back section. I'm going to be taking the hair into small sectioned slices. I'm going to be leaving the same section between each foil. I want to make sure that I am putting a lot of small highlights in there because we are looking to achieve a brighter red look with that dark base. I want to make sure that my section is so thin that I can read through it. That's to make sure that the lightener gets saturated evenly on all the hair strands in that foil. I try to close up my foils as neatly as possible so that they do not slide or cause any bleed marks on any of the other hair. As you reach the top of your triangle at the apex of the head, you will notice that the width of your sections continue to get smaller because it's in a triangle. So the bottom will always be wider and the top will be definitely smaller than the bottom width. As you get to the apex of the head, you want to leave that one little section slice out so there would be no lightener on the top piece of every triangle section at the apex of the head, which would leave a six pointed star shape across that apex of all the slices that were left out from each side. As we come to the side of the head, as you can see, I did not do a slice there. I actually weaved in at the scalp a baby light. I'm going to do two of those back to back on the side of the scalp, on both sides actually, and also in the front. So then when she pulls her hair back, you don't have a huge demarcation line of the slice. You can see it again on that side. After the first two baby light slices, I will then slice the rest of that section up to the apex like I did the others. I want to make sure that when I'm doing the baby light 
highlights that I am putting tension at the rest of the hair to make sure that I get a nice weave out of there. See how I hold the hair down and then weave through the section? When I begin the next section, I will take the hair that was intertwined with those two foils and grab the next section available to slice. Now I'm going to be putting the darker red brown color all through the rest of the hair that was left out in between the foils. Now that we have taken out all the highlights and we have washed them up, I am actually going to section her hair into four so that I can apply the cherry red color that's going to coat those highlights. Now as you can see, we're coating the highlights so that she will have cherry red all over. Now this is our finished product, but we're gonna take it out to the light in the sun so you can really see that finish. She is definitely feeling herself. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks.